Hey, this is Coltrane from Necrotics Gaming. I am bringing you a Titan video today. Um, a little bit different on Prismatic. It's going to be melee based. There's a surprise and using Consecration. There's a surprise, but it's a little bit more fun using this Monte Carlo here. Even though I've got PvP footage up right now, it's mainly going to be for PvE. Um, but super fun. Um, even held up in PvP today. So we'll get on with the video in a second, but I would like to say thank you for all your support. If you would like to hit that subscribe and help me grow my channel, that would be very much appreciated. And the more subscribers I get, the bigger the content, and the more frequency it will come out with. Okay, so today the point of this build is to get as much explosive action using the exotic that we'll cover in a minute. But you can see this is going to pretty much run the way I normally do and I'm using Thunder Crash going for an over the top Titan. You can see the uh, standards I'm running and obviously Frenzy Blade is very important for this. Pulse Grenade and I'm going to be using Knockout because I want to get that Amplified going. We're going to be rocking out Radiant or all other buffs that we can. And the thing with the knockout is getting those overpowered melee with the arc and the consecration. We're going to be using the exotic to buff this even more, get a bigger explosion, plus having the radiant, getting the scorch and ignitions. So you can see I'm using the facet of grace. And this really is about melee build, so it's it's a lot of fun. So we're going to be using the facet of dawn. We're going to be using the facet of balance. Because you're going to be wanting to bring back your um, transcendence pretty quick, so we've set up for that as well. Facet of Awakening. And we're also going to be using the Facet of Sacrifice. These all work very well together for this build, and the build is a ton of fun. Like I said, if you like this build, hit me up for a dim link and I'll send it to you. And don't forget that subscribe. Here you go, the Monte Carlo absolutely awesome auto rifle I love auto rifles and the thing I really like about that is it works super well with this with the severance enclosure because of the severance enclosure getting those powered melee hits and the Monte Carlo with the catalyst you will get the uh, Markov chain which will give you what you need to empower your melee using the bayonet. The so you can see all the parts I was using there. Slow it down, copy them, and um, check out the rest of this footage. This is a super fun build. Use that um, Monte Carlo to get those bayonet kills with it, and you'll be getting back your melee energy in the daytime. And also using the Severance Enclosure you'll be putting out a hell of a lot of damaging explosions with your melees and your finishes. So have at it, have fun with it, and um, see you on the news, enjoy, and I'll see you in the next video.
why Clovis built the portal. Greed. Obsession. The list is long. If you are... know why Clovis built the portal. Greed. Obsession. The list is long. If you asked him, he would have told you he was saving humanity. Collecting the radiolarium fluid from the Vex that came through was the prime purpose. I wanted it shut down. Clovis wouldn't have it. Once again, he flew too close to the sun, and once again, the rest of us paid for it. Bastard. 